Hey everyone, this is Dan. Thanks for joining me. Today I'm hiking through Coulson's Promontory National Park in southern Victoria, most southerly point of mainland Australia. Very smoky conditions, very hot. Some bad fires all across the country. And we're breathing in all the smoke from that at the moment. Oh man, disaster. Worst thing on the trail just happened. I just set my bag up on this ledge over here. Sure enough, it tipped over and two out of three of my beers exploded everywhere <laughs> from my pack. It's ringing wet and I've wasted two of my three beers. So that sucks. But on a positive note, silver lining, as I still managed to save one. Oh boy. Damn it. <laughs> okay, all the beers cleaned up. Um, it didn't wet too much, thank goodness, except my bag. And bad news is now I smell like beer. I think I've attracted every blowfly in this part of the bush. I'm just getting smashed by them. Those beers smelt really good too. So that makes it worse. But I don't get to drink them. I think I'm almost to the top of this ridge. To the saddle and then down to the ocean. But it's um... The smoke sort of turned to cloud, which is good because it's um, dropped the temperature a lot. It's not so hot and sticky. It's a nice cool breeze. It doesn't stink of smoke. Quite a view. Alright, started to flatten out. Must be uh, near the top of the saddle. It's great to see every little bit of elevation. Just has this whole new set of flora. The forest just completely changes like that. Every section away around each bend. It's really cool. Just keeps it really interesting. Beautiful spot. I think I'm right at the tippy top now. Right inside a cloud. It's pretty awesome, pretty windy. It's actually come on cold. It's nice. It's been hot and muggy all day. It's just like this beautiful breeze now. As you can see, it starts to drop now. So I think that's my incline section almost done. I'm here at the rest stop now by the looks of things. Then I can uh, start sinking down the hill. So Windy Saddle definitely lived up to its expectations and I'm on the ocean side of the mountain now and it's just coming to this really lush rainforest which is just beautiful. Beautiful ferns, just spectacular through here. That moss, that lichen, I just love that stuff.
everywhere you look. It's just gorgeous. And that's how you get fresh drinking water. Beautiful. Nice and cold. So I just stopped here for a bit of a rest and I found something pretty cool. Come and check this out. It just keeps going. Full of crickets. No idea how deep that goes. Very spooky. It's like a looks like a wombat must live under there. Very deep. It's insane. The track's really undulating and boulderous around here, which is, makes for some pretty incredible um, sightseeing. That's my first glimpse of the ocean. And by the looks of that, I've still got a long way to walk.
just come across a brown snake on the side, just laying in the sun, just there. Scurried off. But I don't think he's gone far. Always puts the wind up ya. Seen a snake on the trail, that's for sure. This swamp's a really fascinating place. It's got um, these huge trees everywhere, but it's also got fallen trees everywhere. It looks like the trees grow to a certain height and the shallow roots just can't hold them anymore. So they must just get trees falling down here all the time. And so many of these really tall trees are just dead. It's really strange. Makes it a bit intimidating actually, walking under these giants swaying in the strong wind. Woo! I made it to Silas Cove. I made it to the campsite. It's a beautiful spot. I was going to camp next to this fallen tree. It's a little clearing here. But I think I might set up here. It's looking pretty good to me. Little two dollar one at a garage sale should be interesting. The only thing is, I haven't got a pump, <laughs> I'm already lightheaded. We'll see how this goes. My lone survivor.
right, so we're gonna start making the long trek back now. This is a rainy morning. Such a beautiful spot here, absolutely love it. So I've got about 10 Ks to get back. So glad I came here. It's one of the most spectacular beaches. It's been a good trip.